Yes. <laughs> you want to say hi to everybody? Ew, no. You say hi to everybody. You can like, eat my face. Now that I'm adequately covered in dog hair. Okay, here's the sleep. This is the Sixth Sense, take one. Hey guys, welcome back to Diet Jesus. My name is Maple, and today I'm gonna to be watching The Sixth Sense. <laughs> I'm always the worst at this. If you guys wanna watch the full reaction, be sure to check us out on Patreon, and don't forget to like and subscribe. Dang, this movie has all the stars. All right, we're starting off with some very ominous music. Bruce Willis. I feel like I should know who that is. Okay, maybe my headphones are too loud. I feel like M. Night Shyamalan is a popular name, but I can't say I really know a lot about M. Night Shyamalan. There's like a meme. Oh, an M. Night Shyamalan plot twist. So I guess we'll figure this out. I hate basements. This looks like a basement. I like her dress. What? Ooh, see? I don't like basements, man. That is one fine frame. One fine frame, that is. I never told you, but you sound a little like Dr. Seuss when you're drunk. <laughs> Serious, I am. I <laughs> they called you their son. Wow. Wow. Finally, someone is recognizing the sacrifices you've made. That you have put everything second, including me those families that they're talking about i believe what they wrote is real that's a good wife yeah <laughs> the heck look what is someone in the house <laughs> oh stop girl don't do that to me <laughs> You better get ready to swing. Put your hands up, dog. Oh God, why? Oh, okay. Thank God he's not all the way naked. <laughs> oh, but who is that? Daddy, don't move. Don't make a sound. Is it a patient? You've broken a window and entered a private residence. You don't know so many things. What the? F <sighs> what is happening? You know why you're afraid when you're alone? No. I do. I do. <laughs> what do you want? What he promised me! What would he promise me? Oh my god. <laughs> Don't you even remember your own patience? See? <laughs> now look at me! <laughs> I don't want to be afraid no more. Just give me a minute to see. I waited 10 years for you. Oh my god. I'm not giving you nothing. Ben Friedkin. Some people, they call me freak. I do remember you. Thank god. Unusually compassionate. You forgot cursed. Cursed. You failed me! Vincent, I'm sorry if I wasn't. If I didn't help you. What is on his back? You just give me a chance. Whoa! Baba! Oh, 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 oh. oh no! Oh, oh, no! Oh my god! Oh shoot it! Don't talk. Girl, call 911! What? We are off to the to a that's insane. A crazy start, the next fall. Okay. Oh, he's going back and reading. About Vincent. Possible mood disorder. Hey. Looks like me. Damn. Just like following this kid. Dude, I'd say that kid doesn't want to talk to you, man. I like the the framing of the doors. Those shots are 
Like, I don't know, they're just nice to look at. My name is Dr. Malcolm Crow. We were supposed to meet today, but I missed our appointment. I'm sorry. I noticed your eyeglasses. They don't have any lenses in them. They're my dad's. Huh. What were you talking about with your soldiers when I came in? De... De profundis clamo ad te domine. De profundis. Blah, 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 blah. De de oh, what's happening there? Are you a good doctor? Well, I used to be. I'm going to see you again, right? If that's okay with you. Maybe. <laughs> oh, just straight up stole that little statue. Sleeping already? Out of the out of the what? Out of the depths I cry to you, O oh Lord. Why does the music just keeps... I don't know. I'm like freaked out, kinda. <gasps> A puppy. Cole. Hey, your Cocoa Puffs are getting soggy. Cocoa Puffs. Okay, I'm left to the impression that maybe something... <gasps> Jesus freaking... Christ. Something you were looking for, baby? Pop-tarts? They're right here. Ugh. What are you thinking, Mama? Ugh. Scared me, I don't even remember what I was gonna say. That, that's Tommy. Okay, okay, you tuck it in. Hey, Cole. Scared the freaking bejesus out of me. Okay. I don't know what to think. I don't know what to think. Creek. How'd you like that arm around the shoulder bit? I just made that up. I went with it. His little hat, he's so cute. It just switches to like ominous so fast. The music really does that. We're gonna talk about the cabinets, maybe? How was your day? I am gonna make you some triangle pancakes. We got an hour. <laughs> he dresses like such a dapper little man. Wanna play a game? Here's how it works. I read your mind. If what I say is right, you take one step towards the chair. If what I say is wrong, you take one step back. Okay, he's gonna read his mind. Here we go. <laughs> the noise. When your mother and father were first divorced, your mom went to see a doctor like me, and he didn't help her. So you think I'm not going to be able to help you? Sprints to chair. You're worried that she said she told him things. Things she couldn't tell anyone else. You have a secret, but you don't want to tell me. Your dad gave you that watch as a present just before he went away. Went away. Yeah, okay, that's what I was gonna say before she scared the daylights out of me, was... Oh, incorrect. I forgot to do chore. Does it work? But he's talking. Was that, is like his dad dead? Where's the dad? You keep pretty quiet in school, but... You're a good student. You've never really been in any serious trouble. We're supposed to draw a picture. Anything we wanted. I drew a man. Got hurt in the neck by another man with a screwdriver. Well. 
You saw that on TV, Cole? Everyone got upset. Mom started crying. I don't draw like that anymore. How do you draw now? They don't have meetings about rainbows. No. I guess they don't. <sighs> what am I thinking now? I don't know what you're thinking now. thinking you're nice but you can't help me Ooh, damn i thought you meant the other italian restaurant i asked you to marry me in i doubt there was another italian restaurant that you asked her cole has scratches on his arm i think they might be fingernail cuts oh yeah and that guy had like the scratches on his back I don't think she's gonna really say anything. Okay, well. Well. Okay, what's with the temperature thing? Hmm. Hmm. An orb? Look at the other pictures, is it in... Interesting. Do you know what free association writing is, Cole? No. A tent. Free association writing is when you take a pencil in your hand and to keep your hand moving long enough, words and thoughts start coming out that you didn't even know you had in you. Could be something you heard somewhere else or feelings you had deep inside of you. What did that just say? Have you ever done any free association writing, Cole? Yes. Uh... What did you write? Upset words. If you could change something in your life, anything at all, what would it be? I don't want to be scared anymore. Hmm. Bruises may in fact be self-inflicted. What are we reading about? Figured maybe you just wanted to get out and get some air really because you'd seem kind of down lately. Ooh, Mr. Steel Yo Mr. Steel Yo girl? What did I almost just say? Keep moving, cheese dick. What a random insult. Stay fresh, cheese bags. Can anyone guess what this building was used for a hundred years ago? Something horrible. Yes, coal. They used to hang people here. I said something horrible. That's not correct. Uh, where'd you hear that? They pulled the people in crying and kissing their families. Bye. Uh, Cole, this, this building was a legal courthouse. This whole building was full of uh, lawyers, uh, lawmakers. They were the ones that hanged everybody. Uh, okay. I, don't, I don't know which one of these guys told you that. I don't know. Check your facts, Teach, because he might be right. I don't like people looking at me like that. Well, I, uh, I, I don't know how else to look. I... You're a stuttering Stanley. You talked funny when you went to school here. You talked funny all the way to high school. Damn. What? You shouldn't look at people. It makes them feel bad. How did you- Stop looking at me. Who have you been speaking to? Stuttering Stanley, stuttering Stanley. Whoa. Oh god, no, Teach, that is not the answer for that. Okay, so, yeah, there's a lot going on with this child. How's it going? I don't want to talk about anything right now. I feel like this doc, he's a little in over his head. Anna is like my sister. And you better make her happy. And I'm not talking about no, mm, this tastes like real butter kind of happy. I'm talking about... 
Julie Andrews, mm -hmm, twirling around like a mental patient on a mountaintop kind of happy. Now, that's the kind of happy I'm talking about. <laughs> Is that a reference to the sound of music? We love you from the first time she met you on the street. Never in my life have I ever felt that way. Oh. I love you guys. How are, I would have moved out of the house, probably. Are we concerned because the antidepressant bottle is full, or are we concerned because she's taking an antidepressant? Last time was a Chuck E. Cheese party a year ago. They hid in one of those purple plastic tunnels and didn't come out. Chuck E. Who? Cheese. It's a kid's place. What, you've never been to Chuck E. Cheese? I don't know about that. I don't know what that means, but I don't know. Mm -mm. <laughs> I don't know. It's a lot darker up there than it looked down there. Sir. Is someone out there? If you can hear me, open this door. What door? I swear in my life I didn't take the master's horse. Open this door, I'll break through it and grab you. What? Star the commercial always gets so trailer. Okay, so homeboy hears like spirits. Oh yeah, my dad made me invite him. Uh, I hope these kids get the bejesus scared out of them so they stop being mean to him, cause uh... Is there something you want to see in there? No. You're a little jerk. What a bunch of little assholes! Sorry. Oh my god! Yeah, those kids are a bunch of freaking jerks! <gasps> what? Yeah, I know, god. Yeah, girl, I don't know. She's scaring the crap out of me. Yeah, hi. Oh, dang. There's some cuts and bruises on your son that are concerning me. Man. You think I hurt my child? What happened to my child today? Hey. It was the whatever entity was in the closet about taking the horse or something. Did your father used to tell you bedtime stories? Tell okay, so. story about why you're sad. Yeah, let's get, let's get into the real, yeah, the real stories. I'm not supposed to talk about stuff like that. Come on, dude, you need to find a way to relate to this poor kid in some way. That's not. Once upon a time, there was this person named Malcolm. He worked with children. He loved it. He loved that more than anything else. And then one night he found out that he made a mistake with one of them. Ever since then, things have been different. Yeah, we've left out a lot of details. And his wife doesn't like the person that he's become. They barely speak anymore. They're like strangers. And then one day Malcolm meets this wonderful little boy. A really cool little boy. If he could help this new boy be like helping that other one too. It's kind of selfish. I mean, it uh, like if he can do it, it's good, but it's like he's doing it for a reason that's not, oh, I don't know. Like it is, but it isn't. Like it, it's a benefit to him as well. Okay, do it. I want to know. Well, I want to know what he thinks his secret is. I see dead people. In your dreams? No, dog. While you're awake? Yeah, homie. Walking around like regular people. They don't see each other. They only see what they want to see. 
Uh oh. How often do you see them? He's like a little psychic medium. All the time. Oh, buddy. They're everywhere. You won't tell anyone my secret, right? I was gonna say the hospital has to be the worst place for that. Oh yeah, he's got like a huge bruise on his neck. He's suffering from visual hallucinations. Paranoia. No, dude! No! Medication. Hospitalization may be required. Well, maybe. I don't know. But no! And I'm not helping him. No, not maybe. The freaking cabinets! You can't explain that, okay? Like... You just can't. All right, so he's confessed that he sees dead people. Say that maybe he was just like hearing things, like a clairaudience type of thing, Clair some clairvoyance. What's going on? Owie. Hi, this is Lynn Sear, Cole's mom. What is he doing? She's got a pee. Why is it doing that? Why is the temperature dropping? Not even just a little bit. <laughs> God, and you could see his breath. Oh my goodness. Mama. <gasps> Dinner is not ready. What are you gonna do? You can't hurt me anymore. Oh God, oh my God. Lenny, you're a terrible husband, Lenny. Look what you made me do. Wait, I'm so confused. I'm so confused. Oh my gosh, all of the things he's took. Oh. You know, one time I did a performance and we were all dressed. It was uh, the monkeys on the bed story. My mom filmed the wrong kid the entire time. The whole time. This Tommy kid sounds like a real punk. Tommy sucks butt. Better than cats. <clears throat> oh, cats is great. I freaking love cats, the musical. Cole, I was really interested in what you told me at the hospital. I'd like to hear more about it. Whoa. What? What? <gasps> baby, baby, I didn't want to see them. I didn't want to see that. Something up there? Yeah, kinda. <clears throat> That's terrible. Sometimes you feel it inside. Like you're falling down real fast. But you're really just standing still. That's them. When they get mad. They get mad? Are you sure they're there? Come on, man. You gotta feel it. Please make Shout up the stairs. Be gone, demons! <sighs> oh, I freaking love Halloween and fall and pumpkins. <laughs> oh. Is this the commercial? Gentle, fast, if... Cool. I don't care what they say, this thing is broken. Not a scary thing that's running around your house, scaring the crap out of me, man. I saw what was in your bureau drawer when I was cleaning. Got something you want to confess? The bumblebee pendant? Why do you keep taking it? It was grandma's. 
You know, what if it broke? You'd cry because you miss Grandma so much. So did you move the bubble bee pendant? Come on, Mom. Put two and two together. It's a ghost. Don't get mad. Maybe someone came in our house, took the bumblebee pendant out of my closet, and placed it nicely in your drawer. Maybe. God, I am so tired, Cole. I'm tired in my body. I'm tired in my mind. I'm... I need some help. You know, I don't know if you noticed, but our little family isn't doing so good. I mean, I've been praying. But I must not be praying right. Did you take the bumblebee pendant? Oh. No. Oh. You need to leave the table. Go! What? Oh no, that's not good. What's in there? Ah! Boy? Absolutely not. Hey, come on. I'll show you where my dad keeps his gun. Come on. Hold on. Sebastian, come on. Mama? If you're not very bad. I sleep in your bed tonight. Look at my face. I'm not very mad. Oh, she just doesn't understand. Baby, why are you shaking? Cause there's a freaking ghost in his room with his head, the back of his head blown out. Oh God, please tell me. Oh, please. First edition. Wow. <laughs> She's so thoughtful, you know. What do you want more than anything? Oh. I told you what I want. Just... Do. What? What was that? I know what I want. Why is everybody always breaking the windows? Like there was no one else in the world except us. Uh. I can't be your doctor anymore. I haven't paid enough attention to my family. Do you understand? No. I'm going to transfer you. I know two psychologists. Don't me. Yeah, he told you his secret, bro. Someone else can help you. You can believe me, right? I don't know how to answer that, Cole. Uh. Do you know why you're afraid when you're alone? I do. I do. Mm. What are you looking at? You're freaking me out. It's cold in here. What are we listening for? Ghost? Yeah, put it together, man. Give us something! An EVP! Ooh. Max volume. Yeah, come on! Want to be a Lance Corporal in Company M, 3rd Battalion, 7th Marines? We're being dispatched in the Quang Nam province. Maybe later. Huh. Something happened, didn't it? You know what yo no quiero morir means? In Spanish. It means I don't want to die. What do you think these ghosts want when they talk to you? Thank you, God. Just help. That's right. That's what I think, too. They just want help, even the scary ones. And I think I might know a way to make them go away. How do you know for sure? I don't. I don't know. I mean, boy's got- has had scratches and bruises all over his body, so... What if it's something that's, like, worse than a ghost? Ugh. <sighs> Is he gonna take? Is he gonna take the advice? What's happening to you? I was having a bad dream. Oh. Mama, you sleep now. It's freaking me out. Who's he gonna run into? It's freaking me out. 
Oh no, not again, bro. <laughs> I don't want another jump scare, man. Crooked, crooked camera angle. Hey, ghost. Ooh, oh, girl. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, it's gross. It's nasty. What? Oh, no. Ugh, just a minute, Autumn. I know. It's okay. Homegirl's just chilling under the blanket. Okay. With all that vomit coming out of her mouth. I'm feeling much better now. Are you? Do you want to tell me something? Gosh dang it, I want to know how it went. She came a long way to visit me, didn't she? Okay, why did- so why did we bring him here? I just can't imagine a child being in bed for two years. Oh my god, okay. I just heard the uh, little one is falling ill now. It's that girl. Okay. Don't go home, okay? I definitely won't. It's never fun to be sick. Uh... All the puppets? Is it necessary? Oh my god, why? God dang it. Sweetie, get out from underneath the bed. You could just, you know, like as a ghost, you could just, like normal, just pop up like normal, like we don't have to do all of that. Jesus. <sighs> Mister? Mm -mm. Are you curious, Daddy? Yes, I think so. Hmm, VHS, okay. Disgusting. And the awful thing is, is that does happen and has happened. It's about to freaking go down at this funeral, man. Oh my god. You were keeping her sick. Is Kara coming back? No. Not anymore. No. They're uh, calling for the stable boy. All I can think about is that little boy that that mom was like putting salt into his into his fluids or his feeding tube that shouldn't have been given to him. Oh no. Just practicing my lines. You know, when I went to school here, there was a terrible fire in the section of the theater. They rebuilt the whole thing. Yeah, I know. Yeah. A <laughs> little wizard. He's a stable boy. He cleans up after the horses. Silence, village idiot. <laughs> Let the boy step forward. How cute. 
This is his moment. <laughs> so cute. I thought you were really great in the play call. Really? Yeah. I thought Tommy Tomasimo sucked big time. <laughs> Village idiot. I got an idea how you can talk to your wife. Wait till she's asleep. Then she'll listen to you and she won't even know it. Ah, like break the subconscious, yes. Break her into her subconscious mind. Not gonna see you anymore, am I? I think we said everything we needed to say. Maybe we can pretend like we're gonna see each other tomorrow. Just for pretend. Okay. I'll see you tomorrow, Cole. A crash? Jeez, I hope nobody got hurt. You're mad I missed the play, aren't you? I'm ready to communicate with you now. Okay. You know the accident up there? Someone got hurt. She died. Oh my god, but you can see her? Where is she? Standing next to my window. Oh, you're scaring me. They scare me too sometimes. Ghosts. You see ghosts, Cole? Yes. Yes, he does. You think I'm a freak? Look at my face. I would never think that about you. Ever. Got it? Got it. Grandma says hi. <laughs> she says she's sorry for taking the bumblebee pendant. She just likes it a lot. Cole, that's very wrong. She wanted me to tell you. Cole, please. She wanted me to tell you she saw you dance. He's about to lay the facts on her. She did. Oh. She hid in the back so you wouldn't see. She, she said you were like an angel. I'm okay. I'm just crying a little bit, okay? It's all right. I know. It's okay. Just come here. Come Every here. Every day. Oh. What did you ask? Do I make her proud? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Tell me. I know. I'm just crying. It's okay. Thank you. You're so sweet. You're so sweet. Thank you, love. Anna. I miss you. I miss you too. What is it? What? Why did you leave me? I didn't leave you. A minute they only see what they want to see no dude oh <gasps> dude he's freaking dead I thought in movies, if you got shot in the side, that you'd be okay. Maybe. Okay, baby, not. Call somebody. Ouchie. This ain't hurt anymore. Oh, no. I think I can go now. Huh. <sighs> I just needed to do a couple things. I needed to help someone. Oh my god, and he helped you. 
And I needed to tell you something. You were never second. <laughs> Ever. No. I love you. You sleep now. <sighs> Everything will be different in the morning. Night Shyamalan film. Autumn, what'd you think? What'd you think of the movie? What'd you think, Tom? Was it good, Tommy?